Hey, Lower Elementary. This is Miss Williams, and today we're going to take a look at your movable alphabet. Some of you received a yellow folder. You may have a different color folder, but every folder on the inside will have these clear protectors. You will also have the letters for your movable alphabet. Some of them may be cut up already and in a bag. Others may be in a bag, but you may still need to do some work and cut them up. After you finish cutting your letters out, you will then need to sort them. When sorting, you're going to put like letters together, all the M's together, the Y's, there's a W. I can make a new pile. A V. Oh, there's another Y. Continue sorting, sorting and stacking your alphabet until you are finished. After you finish sorting your alphabet, you are then going to place the letters in order inside of your clear plastic protector pockets. At the very top of the pocket, there is an opening. There's an opening on the front side. And then when you turn the page, there's also an opening on the back side. So letters can be in the front and the back. I started with the letter A. Next, I'll put in the letter B. It has print on one side. It has cursive on the back. You can decide if you want to use print or cursive. You may also find silent E and other punctuation marks. These along with the blends can have their own pockets. You may want to use this guide to help you get the letters in order. When you come to the end, so I filled up all three rows, A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, and I turn my page, I can use the back side to start with J. It's a separate pocket, so it will keep it separate from C on the other side. After you finish sorting and stuffing each little pocket with the correct letters, you'll have a full movable alphabet to build words and sentences with in a nice and organized way.